first to look beyond the trees. Each uncertain step was a rebellion against extinction, a spark that would one day become us. The earth itself was shifting. Forests retreated, grasslands conquered, and life... The great herds moved first and new, following the ghosts of rivers that no longer flowed. But survival has never been about comfort. It is born from those who dare to leave comfort behind. Something ancient burned in her gaze. Not fear, not hunger, but awareness. Something ancient burned in her gaze. Not fear, not hunger, but awareness. For the first time, they walked toward the unknown. Not by chance, but by choice. And with that step, the long journey toward humanity had begun. They left the safety of the trees and stepped into an ocean of grass. Each rustle could mean food or death. Predators ruled these lands. Their teeth, their speed, their silence, perfect. Our ancestors had none of that. They learned silence, stillness, how to read danger in the rhythm of the wind. But they had something new won, a spark of defiance, the mind beginning to whisper, Fight, not flee. Pain became a teacher. Endurance, their new religion. Together, they moved. <laughs> Empathy. Before civilization, before fire, before language, there was a world untouched. 7.4 million years ago, Life in Africa was a test of endurance. The forests began to die, and with them, the safety of the trees. Those who once lived among the branches were forced to face the open ground. And one day, one dare to stand. The ground was danger, yet it was also destiny. Each uncertain step was a gamble against extinction. But in the dust, they left more than prints. They left the first story. From that moment on, the world would never walk the same. Nature watched, were ruthless, patient, patient, as evolution began to move. Survival was no longer about strength, but care. They stood, not yet human, but no longer beast. The first heartbeat of our kind echoed across the plains. They feared the fire, yet could not look away. It was destruction and warmth, death and light. Survival demanded invention. Where rivers vanished, they learned to find water beneath dust. Step by step, they stopped walking alone. Unity became strength. The herd became family. Knowledge began to flow not in words, but in glances, in gestures, in imitation. The first language of learning, helping another was more than instinct. It was love, forming in the hearts of beings who didn't yet know the word for it. Beneath a thousand stars, they dreamed, perhaps for the first time, of safety, of belonging. Beneath a thousand stars, they dreamed, Perhaps for the first time. The fire was no longer a threat. It became a gathering guide, a symbol of warmth, of light, of togetherness. And so began the story of us, 
Fragile creatures who dared to rise and face the sun. Each footprint carried a story of migration, of discovery, of the first journeys that shaped our kind. Their world was vast and merciless, but the bond that held them together was stronger than fear. For every sunrise, there was a shadow waiting. <clears throat> Survival meant courage. Even without weapons, they stood their ground. A simple act of a throw, a defense grip. Yet in that moment, instinct turned to innovation. They learned to trust each other, to share fear and hope a lie. This was no longer a group, it was a tribe. The world was shifting, storms, droughts, and endless change. To live meant to move. In the giants, they saw reflections of themselves. Strength through unity, peace through kinship. And with each rising sun, their footsteps echoed across eternity. The first humans walking toward the future.